think it's finally time. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, and today we are watching WandaVision. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Thank you so much for being here, and welcome if you're new. Today, we are jumping into a new show, WandaVision. I know that y'all have been waiting for this one. I took a bit of a break between Spider-Man Far From Home and starting WandaVision. A lot of people didn't understand why I was taking a break. They didn't like the fact that I was taking a break. But the way I view it is Marvel films and shows are still being made to this day, and most people have had to wait a certain amount of time between each movie, between each series. I don't want to just solely do Marvel all the time because one, I think that that would overwhelm me. I think it would overwhelm my channel as well, but also just because there's other things that I wanna watch, there's other stuff that I wanna check out. So if I'm constantly doing Marvel and that's taking up space always on my channel, it leaves less room for other stuff. So I wanted to take a little break to kind of give myself some space so that I stay excited for the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but also just to check out some other stuff. In the meantime, we've checked out the Batman trilogy, the How to Train Your Dragon trilogy. We even watched a really intense uh, crime drama action movie, Leon the Professional. I'm still gonna continue to watch stuff that's all over the place, animated movies, different dramas, different comedies, but I'm really excited to be finally jumping into WandaVision. I didn't wanna wait too long because I know that the Black Widow movie is coming out in July. I believe it's coming out July 17th, if I'm not wrong. And I know that I have to watch WandaVision, Falcon and the Winter Soldier, and Loki all before I watch the Black Widow movie. And to be honest, I love Loki, so I'm really excited about that show in particular as well. And I really wanna watch the Black Widow movie, hopefully around the time when it comes out, or at least not too long after it comes out. And uh, at this rate, <laughs> I have a lot of episodes to catch up on. So it might get pushed till August, but um, I do wanna watch it at least this summer. So in order to do that, I have to watch everything else before that movie. I do thank you guys for waiting though. I know that a lot of people are really excited for me to see this show. I've heard good things about it. I've heard that it's really interesting in the way that it's executed and they did things really differently than apparently what you see in other TV shows. I really have no idea what is gonna happen in this show. I've heard no spoilers. I do see from the cover that the vision is in it, so I am happy to see that. We'll probably see more of a relationship between Wanda and the vision, but I do, and I guess it's in the name too. I literally just, I just, I just, I just piece that together. <laughs> I literally did not. I didn't piece that together until just now. For some reason, I was thinking WandaVision. Oh, like, like Wanda, like a TV show, like television, like WandaVision. But no, it's got to be Wanda and the Vision. I'm still new, guys. Okay, cut me some slack. <laughs> or don't. You can roast me. It's fine. Wow, I can't believe it took me that long to get that. <laughs> Obviously, I don't know much about this show. I just have heard that it's really interesting in the way they filmed it, perhaps edited it. I don't really know. So I'm excited to see what they did with it. I did kind of see the, some of the thumbnails just to see how many episodes there were. It's really interesting because some of these look like they're on the stage of a multicam set, like Friends or like Married with Children. And then there are some that look like grounded single cam dramas. So... <laughs> I wonder if that's what people are talking about. Like they just switched the the style up for the way they filmed each episode or maybe even moments between episodes. I don't know. I'm really excited. Real quick though, before we dive on into this new series together, let's have a word from today's sponsor, Trade Coffee. I find that the coffee selection at my local grocery store is just too limited. The solution? Trade connects me with the best coffee from the nation's top roasters that you just can't find at the store. What's even better is that Trade will match you to your own personal selection of coffee based off of your taste preferences and your brewing method. First, take the online quiz to answer questions about how you take your coffee. Next, choose the delivery frequency and your coffee will arrive at peak freshness right when you need it. Lastly, rate your coffee so that Trade can continue to match you with choices you'll love. This coffee was sent to me from Huckleberry Roasters in Denver, Colorado. 
When I specified that I like to cold brew my coffee, I was instantly matched with their flavor, Flores Bellas. I love the bright and smooth flavor and the notes of chocolate. It's definitely the best cold brew I've ever made at home, hands down. And of course, I had to try this coffee from the roasters at Stay Golden as well. Not only does it fit my signature catchphrase, but I was intrigued by the notes of strawberry and caramel, and it did not disappoint. Trade guarantees you'll love your first coffee, but if you don't, they'll ship you a different bag for free. The first 100 people who click the link in the description bar below will get 50% off their first bag. Just click the link and enter the code NATALIEGOLD50 to take the quiz and get your personalized coffee shipped right to your door. Thanks so much to Trade for sponsoring this video and thank you guys for listening to the sponsor. Now let's get back into the show. But that's all I really have to say, guys. I'm just excited to dive back into this universe with y'all, see some familiar characters and faces again, and I really like Wanda, so I'm excited to learn more about her because she's a badass. So with all that being said, I think we should just grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into the series. It's a musical? They're newlyweds and they're moving on the same day they got married. <laughs> I love this 50s style. Oh my god! My husband and his indestructible head. Oh my god, they she's kind of using that semi-transatlantic. That explains the empty refrigerator. <laughs> Well, maybe not. She kind of had the accent for a second, but now it's kind of... I'm just not used to seeing her so perky, because usually Wanda's so grounded and dramatic. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, that's so cute. He can make his face look like human. Oh, so we get to see the real actor, not with just constantly looking like, you know, the vision. Oh my God, I love this old set. I love the style. Hello, dear. I'm Agnes. Oh my God. I love her. Lock, my mother in law was in town, so I wasn't. Ah! She's the best, this actress. Well, I assure you, I'm married to a man, a human one, and tall. A human one. He'll be home later tonight for a special occasion, just the two of us. An anniversary then? Yes. <laughs> Oh, this is gonna be a gas. A gas. Oh, the old phrases. I love it. Oh, the transition. The song. Oh, oh, he's too fast at work. He's got to slow down. You got to slow down there, dude. Gee willikers, that was fast. Gee willikers. You're like a walking computer. Mm. What? I most certainly am not. <gasps> Piers is something special about today. Special to Wanda. That's my wife. And How long have you been at this job, dude? They don't know your wife? Well, it could be, I guess it's a new job. Wife and I are looking forward to this evening. Mr. Hart, of course. Oh. Why would they put a heart on the calendar for, for an employee dinner? No skeletons in your closet, eh, Vision? Your future in this company depends on it. <laughs> it's interesting that he actually goes by Vision. And he doesn't have like a name, like a different name. You could point out that the death rate of single men is twice that of married men. Now that's romantic. Uh-huh. <laughs> Oh, I'm so glad I didn't live in the 50s. Don't worry, dear. I have everything under control. No, she doesn't know. <laughs> Tell her! Well, you know, darling, I still get a little tongue-tied. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. She's gonna... Tonight doesn't go just so. I think this could be the end. Oh! <gasps> glad to know we're both on the same page. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's gonna be like she's gonna... They're gonna show up and she's gonna have made this, like, dinner and be dressed all sexy or something. Try our new and improved Toastmate 2000. Oh, God. For clever housewives. Oh, God. Is this like SNL where we're doing comedy, like, spoof ads? By Stark Industries. Stark! I thought Stark only made weapons, so he started off with toasters. <laughs> How very atmospheric. Kitty! Oh, I love her! Oh, my God, Kitty. No! Oh, this is so bad. Wanda! Vision? Even in the dark, how could you confuse the two? Oh, how exotic. <laughs> I love her. Okay, at least she's not dressed totally inappropriately. Sweetheart. Oh, yes. <laughs> Candles! Oh, wow. Yeah, at least she's magical. She can whip up something. Oh, shall I just preheat the oven then, dear? That won't be necessary. Oh. Won't be necessary. And steak Diane and mint jellies for your maid. Do you set your own jellies, dear? <laughs> I love her! I just love this actress. Bon appétit! <laughs> bon appétit! Human escape put I sense. No, 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 no. Let's take out the papers and the trash. Or you will get no spending cash. Yangity yak! Don't talk back. 
Oh my god. Why don't we have a nice sing-along all together then, shall we? <laughs> he has a ukulele on standby. And on that farm he had a... Oh my god, is this all he knows? I like how Kitty is really on board. I'm gonna keep calling her Kitty. Oh no. Were either of you aware that married men are killing single men at an alarming rate? <laughs> Too much to sharing these facts right now. Oh, now she's fainting. Oh my god. You know, I'm beginning to think you're not management material, Vision. Oh my god. This asshole jo Oh, she did it! She made breakfast! She made breakfast for dinner, but there's also wine. I kind of love it, I'm not gonna lie. What brought you here? How long have you been married? And why don't you have children yet? <gasps> That's a lot of questions, ma'am. And we were married. Yes, yes, we were married. Can they not remember any of their lives? Is it because of the blip? Can they not remember because of the blip and because Vision technically died? What is this? This is the whole point of the episode is to figure this out, huh? Damn it, why? Why did you? Oh God, what's happening to him? Stop it. <laughs> Oh, now we're, oh, it's getting serious. The, the angles just changed from a wide multicam to a, a drama. Stop it. <laughs> and she's just laughing. Oh, this is so spooky. Vision, help him. Oh my God. Whoa. <laughs> oh my God. We totally changed the format. This is crazy. Also, why did Kitty not do anything? Well, would you look at the time? <laughs> Oh, we're back to a sitcom. We're back to a multicam. This is so cool. See about that promotion, huh? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. <laughs> what the f is this show? Today could be our anniversary. Wait, but I thought they got married in this. I guess because in, in the reality of the universe, Vision died. I like how her powers are more than just like telekinetic in this show already. She can just make stuff appear. <laughs> Oh, is he pushing the laugh track button? Did he just push the button for the laugh track? Or for the, for this? Wow, this is already very unique. Oh, are we in the studio? Well, where are we? We're in modern times now? What's going on? Okay, so far very interesting. Catherine Hahn, oh my God. I, I knew her name started with a K, but I was, I was just blanking on her name there. She's incredible, I love her. I think she's hysterical. I wonder if they'll keep the same format or when it will change. That sequence with Fred Alamid's character choking was so trippy and kind of creepy, but cool. Why do they sleep in separate beds? Why do they have separate twin beds? Yeah, there you go. Much better. <laughs> Oh, I love that stylized little hand above the covers to do that. Cause that was a thing you used to see in like old school, like movies and shows. I don't know, you just see physical comedy with like a hand poking out of nowhere. Oh my God, this little cartoon looks like a, is it the Jetsons or whatever it's called? It just looks so old school. I wonder if the intro is gonna change for every single episode. That's so cute. Well, I better get going if I'm gonna make the planning committee meeting. That's me off as well, actually. Those weird close-ups, the close-ups don't really make sense when we're still acting like it. I feel like we're too close on these for the style with the audience, you know? I feel like we don't get normal close-ups like that on a multicam. Like you'll get a little bit of a close-up, but it's not that tight. So it just kind of feels weird. But if we're transitioning, then that's cool. I'm just, maybe we are. Oh, <gasps> it's color. Oh, <gasps> it's not black and white. All right, I take it back. Maybe we were doing those close-ups as part of the transition into a new style. Are you ready to meet Queen Cul-de-Sac and her merry homemakers? <laughs> Queen Cul-de-Sac. The devil's in the details, Bev. That's not the only place he is. <laughs> I love Catherine Hahn. This might help. In the eight years. <gasps> she just brought a flask! <laughs> She's the best. She's clearly the best friend in the group. Those I pants are peachy keen. Was... Peachy keen. All of this is for the children. For the children. For the children. Uh, oh God, it's like cult-like. <laughs> so this whole episode is gonna be her standing out accidentally while trying to fit in. How is anybody doing this sober? <laughs> exactly. I wouldn't be doing this at all. <laughs> Pardon me, is this a neighborhood watch meeting? He wants to join the neighborhood watch. Didn't expect to see you here. Oh, were they talking about him? What's the issue? Raspberry? or cheese filled. Oh, neither for me, thank you. I don't eat food. I don't eat food. <laughs> what I mean to say is that I don't eat food in between meals, but at meal times. Woof, I'm a regular eater of sheep. 
<laughs> oh my god i like vision like this in this dorky comedic setup i think he's suited for that this actor paul bettany is really suited for that style i too have some top secret gossip to share <laughs> norm here's a communist <laughs> Was he, was he just spilling his friend's tea? Oh, he earned, okay, he got in. He got in with the group. We actually thought you were serious. <laughs> oh no, he swallowed it. Oh, we're showing a cartoon of him swallowing it. Oh no. Oh God, what's he gonna do if it got inside of him? That's bad. But I assure you, I don't mean anyone any harm. I don't believe you. Oh, here we go. It's getting trippy again. <laughs> Are they hiding in a television show? Is that what they're doing? Wanda. Like the person that we saw at the end of the episode watching them on a TV? What? Are they like hiding in a TV? What is this? Dottie! Blood! Oh, <gasps> Things in colors! Oh my god, this is so trippy. How does a housewife get a blood stain out of white linen? By doing it herself. <laughs> Whoa, we keep having these like really dramatic moments that like are trying to yank us out of this reality. Oh, it's the same couple from the last toaster commercial. Are they gonna be in every commercial? He'll make time for you. Hydra? Oh God. <laughs> Did they go back in time or are they in a TV show? I feel like they're in TV because that person in that room at the end of the last episode was watching them on a TV with a remote or whatever. Oh no, he's got gum in his <laughs> machine. Wonder oh, no, my little cabbage, you look smashing. The gum made him drunk. What is going on? You are. Oh boy. I like how it says talent show for the children. It does seem like it's for the adults considering there's no children in the audience. <laughs> oh no. I am Glamour and this is my delightful assistant illusion. I am Glamour and he's illusion. Yeah, what she said. One of my favorite things to do in acting is act like I'm drunk. So I already can tell he's having a lot of fun doing this. A staggering feat of strength. Oh no. What? Uh... Oh, she's just saving his ass. That was my grandmother's piano. <laughs> oh, I like that line. That was a cute line. Vision, no. I'm doing it. Oh. 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 <laughs> Shut up, Bev! <Pam. laughs> Don't ask too many questions. I will now make my wife disappear. Are you sure you don't want an audience volunteer named my husband, Ralph? Her husband's not even here. What's in the box? What's in the box? <gasps> oh no. Oh no. Her friend. Is her friend gonna think anything of that? She was just roped into this trick. I like how we keep going back to this cartoon. Oh, she's she's just a magician, man. She's really fixing everything with him. That really gummed up my works, didn't it? Mm. I'm not as funny without it, am I? <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> I liked Drunk Vision. Comedy performance of the year. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, they're making her be a part. They're like, you're, you are a part of it. Come on. Well, that's nice. Oh, a magician never reveals his secrets. He leaves that to his assistant. And she's not talking. I had a feeling you'd say that. <laughs> uh, and she's just fine with that answer. Ah, she's like, okay. For the children. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, this is for the children. Where are the kids? This is just a fundraiser. Why couldn't the kids come to this? It's kind of weird. I mean, I know the real reason is production didn't want to have a bunch of extras that were kids because it's a hassle to deal with. Wonder. Hmm, what? <gasps> she's pregnant all of a sudden? What the f It's really Thudding has got to be people from the outside world. Is Wanda hiding in here because she misses Vision? Like, what is this? Oh God, who is it? I'm sorry, a beekeeper? What? Why is he a beekeeper? Why is it a beekeeper? Oh, she's rewinding like a television. Oh, he's in color. Oh, the whole world's going to color now. Is she changing the show? She's totally hiding in a television, isn't she? So she can be with the one she loves. Is that it? Oh, oh. Who's doing this to you, Wanda? Or who's doing this to you? Maybe she's not hiding. Maybe somebody else put her in there. I'm, I just, I do like the questions I'm being left with. So interesting. Oh my God, it's like 60s style or 70s style. Oh my God, I don't know, but I love it. We're progressing through the decades. 
Oh my God, it's, I love it. It's groovy, I love it. And she, I like how we've progressed through the decades, but she's still pregnant. She's exactly the same level of pregnancy as where we left off. And all their hair is so different. He's reading a book on pregnancy. Oh my God, I love the outfits already. I love it. Wow, their house is so much bigger, it seems. Maybe it's just because the staircase is open. You are at about four months now. Is that right? Uh, they have no clue. Hypothetically speaking, what size fruit would it be at, say, 12 hours? Has she only been pregnant for 12 hours? Oh, well, I guess, yeah, she did go from, she did pop, like, literally while turning. We'd like to keep the news just in the family for right now. Of course. Mum's the word. <laughs> He's gonna tell everyone, isn't he? I don't know how you're gonna hide it. She looks pregnant. Is he malfunctioning? What is he doing? What? Uh, whoa, no. She's more preg pregnant? Is she gonna like have a one day pregnancy? Yeah, if I have a baby, this will totally be me because I love planning and organizing and lists. <gasps> oh. Kicking? It's kind of fluttery. <laughs> Uh-oh. Their house is about to get weird because she's pregnant, isn't it? Is the baby magical or did the baby do that? Did the baby do it? Billy? Yeah. Well, I was thinking Tommy. Just a nice classic all-American name. Yeah, Billy is so not an American name, huh? Billy is so just different. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I bet it's her baby. Phil's with this woman? Oh my God. Oh no, they all had a power outage, oh boy. With all the close calls we've been having, it seems the people of Westview are always on the verge of discovering our secret. Why are people laughing right now? Oh, we're gonna acknowledge how weird it is? I think something's wrong here, Wanda. Yes, I know what you mean. Did she just rewind and do it over? Oh, I feel bad. I feel like Wanda's somehow forced herself to live in a television so she can be with her, the one she loves because she can't in the real world. Did her water break and that's why it's raining in the house? Maybe it is her accidentally doing all these things. Oh, an ad, another ad. Oh, I think this is the same woman too, just with a different hairstyle. Hydra silk. Oh. Find the goddess within. Mm. Has anyone ever actually been fanned with grape leaves in like modern times and liked it? Darling, do you think it's time to- Call the doctor. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I do, dear. Well, the doctor is probably in, the, in Bermuda by now. I better leg it. Huh? Where is he going? <laughs> A bird is chirping? Is it a stork? Are you kidding me? Wanda, what's up? Oh, hi, Geraldine. You know, now's not really a good time. No, 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 it's Foxy. You'll have to let me borrow it sometime. But first, I gotta borrow a bucket. How did she not understand that? That doesn't even make sense how she wouldn't understand that. Would you look at that? What? Fruit. <sighs> <laughs> it's a good thing that everybody's really oblivious in this world. You know how I've been working that temp job, right? Oh, she's just sitting down. Oh, no. Crazy yesterday. <laughs> oh, my God, there is a stork behind her. Uh, tell me about the temp job. <laughs> oh, that's my girl. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. Look at this bird. The stork is coming. The baby's coming. <laughs> Did you... Did you hear that? No. No. Why not just admit that a bird ended up in your house? That would be the perfect thing to say. A bird wandered into our house. That keeps my cool no matter what's going down. So I look at the client. This girl is doing a great job doing this monologue all on her own. Oh, there's fish on her pants. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I need some office supplies. Do y'all still keep those in your spare room? Oh God. The bird is freezing? What? Ah! The baby's coming. You're oh. pregnant? <laughs> this friend is going to be the first one to figure out that Wanda is a little different, built different. Well, is everything okay with the wife? <laughs> Never mind the fact that he just showed up. Oh, he's running with him like this? Oh, boy. What about my brand new two-piece? Oh, my God. Never mind that the vision just showed up in a blur. Oh, my God. Geraldine, do you not notice that the house has come alive? <laughs> oh, she is noticing it. Okay. <laughs> I like that Geraldine is the one who's being let in on this. It's time to start pushing. How do you know this, Geraldine? You're not a nurse. <laughs> oh my God, the house is gonna be on fire soon. Oh look, it's perfectly swaddled and everything, ready to go for television. <laughs> oh no, I missed it. Oh. We went so fast, it was. <laughs> Wow, they really did find a baby with bright blue eyes. Wow, you guys are taking some liberties right now. Tommy? Yes, Tommy. Aww. Ah! Oh! 
She's having twins? I bet it's another boy. And it's gonna be Billy and Tommy. Oh wow, they had twins, that's crazy. And she's standing real quick. I guess fast pregnancy, fast healing. I think you might have what it takes to be a nurse. Obviously. I don't think we'll get away after all. Small towns, so hard to escape. <laughs> that's spooky as Oh, another spooky thing, oh boy. Howdy, neighbors! Hey. Howdy! They're trying to repair the wall. Oh no, they're whispering about him, oh boy. Oh, look at the wall, it looks so painted, like um, the Truman Show. Is Geraldine inside with Wanda? Why, what's wrong with Geraldine? She's lovely. I'm a twin. Oh, right, she is a twin. Oh my god, I completely forgot that she was a twin. Oh my god. Oh god, is Geraldine about to figure something out, or break, or what's going on? Oh boy, she's piecing stuff together. He was killed by Ultron. Was Geraldine planted here? What did you say? She's new to town. Brand new. Geraldine is new. Oh, she was planted here. Is she trying to snap Wanda out of it? What did you say about Pietro? Oh boy. Oh, it's, oh, it's intense. Oh boy. What's that necklace mean? She came here because... Why do the neighbors know everything? I guess they're nosy neighbors. Why did she come here? Why do you guys know? She came here because we're all... Are we all dead here? What is this? That looks like an upside down cross. What's that for? I, uh... Oh my god, the baby crying piped in with the music is really intense. Because we're all- Stop it! No, don't stop it! Are you dead? What's going on? Somebody tell me! Oh my god, where did Geraldine go? She had to rush home. Why did the- The screen just went from narrow to widescreen. Oh my god! Where are we now? <laughs> she got kicked out. Wanda kicked her out. Oh my god. Are we now in a grounded drama? Oh yeah, all these trucks are here for her. We're in the real world. Holy <laughs> Oh, they have guns on her? What? What was that wall of electric, telestatic electricity? Oh my god! I am mind blown right now. Wow. Are they all dead in there? What's going on? <laughs> well, so far, this show is definitely interesting. And unlike any other, I wonder how it's going to progress. I definitely have a lot of questions about what's going on, why Wanda is in this world in this television world how this world exists did she create it or did somebody else create it was she put here and trapped here or did she consciously choose to go there i'm kind of leaning towards she consciously chose to go there because it seems like she wants to be with vision but i have no clue how this show is going to progress i will say i do wonder if it's going to have lasting power because i feel like a show like this isn't really meant to go on for a ton of seasons. It feels like so far the concept of it might only work for a season or two. Obviously, if something different pops up and surprises me, then that could change. But at the moment, it seems like what we have going on, even though there's still a lot of questions that are unanswered and I want to get to the bottom of them, I feel like I don't know how much further it could go on but because it's still really new to me i'm enjoying it thus far and i'm really curious about what the hell is going on <laughs> i honestly don't have too much to say about the series because so far it's just left me with a lot of intrigue and a lot of questions and because these past few episodes have been so short we haven't really dived into a lot it's just kind of left me with a lot of cliffhangers and interesting things that i want the answers to but don't have so at this point in time i don't really have too much to say about it but it is fun and definitely different and i am enjoying it so i'm interested to see where it goes from here but for now that's all i have for you guys in this video so if you liked it please give it a thumbs up because it really helps me out and it lets me know that you guys want to see more content like this let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and anything else you might like me to watch next and subscribe if you want to till the next one stay golden bye